I'm Andy True, hanging out with YouTube sensation, singer and star of Powerpuff Girls, Wenji. Hey, thanks for having me. So from being a YouTube sensation, you've now moved into music. What gave you the confidence to move into music? Um, actually, <laughs> Prince Max supported me a lot on that. Like, I actually had no confidence moving into music. I was like, no, this is not, no, like, you see my music videos on YouTube. I released some covers. I'm like, no, I, I can't do this. But he was like really supportive. He was like, yeah, you can. Like, come, try it out. Like, I'm here to help you. So he's been like really instrumental with helping me. What tips would you give someone that wants to do the same? For me, like definitely start on accessible channels like YouTube or, you know, social media. I think a lot of Singers these days can get a decent audience on YouTube doing covers and things like that. And like even events like VidCon over the weekend, there are some like singers that have just grown on YouTube and they have so many fans. There's like 500 people lining up to meet her. Um, and like it's just crazy how much you can just do by yourself online. You don't need a record label to come and tell you, oh, now we want you to be a singer. Or you don't need someone to tell you that. Like that's what I love about you. Wenji, you've been super busy over these last couple of years. What have you been up to? Wow, I don't even remember what I did last week. This is, this is difficult. <laughs> well, like for me, like I was concentrating on my YouTube channel mainly for the first couple of years. And when that really took off, to my complete surprise, um, all these other opportunities started like literally opening up, including this role for Powerpuff. And, um, like I've never done voice acting like I've done like obviously from the YouTube channel I've done like my own content so yeah this voice acting thing has been very new. How did you prepare for this role? Um, so we went and did an audition they kind of tested whether I was okay with the voices of the episodes and then once I was okayed and they said I got the role um, then it was just a process of like throwing me in a room with a microphone but it was just literally like we want your voice. I understand that you get your voice up really high. Did you have to, you know, get a lot of help with that? For me, I actually asked them, like, do you want me to put on a voice? And they actually said, we want your voice. So I was like, oh, that's pretty easy. Like, I just talk, right? Um, but there was a bit where she was younger and I had to put on a little bit of a higher voice. Um, there's this part that I practice a lot in my, in my room with my, my flatmates probably got deaf from hearing me do this because it's like screaming. So this is part where, um, you know, she she wants cereal. And then she goes, I want milk! So yeah, okay. it's very piercing. She's a very, very angsty little kid. And finally, what's next for Wenji? Um, uh, for me, like music is definitely going to be a huge focus when we're coming up. And that's something I want to get better at as well. Ooh.